Hi, I'm Emma, fresh from London to follow the DHL NZ Lions series. My mighty Lions are taking on the best teams in New Zealand and we'll be roaring along in our very own painted Brits camper vans. If you see us, come say hi to the Vodafone Rugby Road Trip. The Vodafone Rugby Road Trip has come to Christchurch Boys High School that has produced 46 All Blacks over the years. And I'm joined here by current co-captains, Adam and Ryan. So Adam, we've just walked down that corridor. What does that mean to you as a current student? Oh, it's just pretty cool when you're at Boys High every day and you walk through the corridors to your classes and whatnot and you see all those names there. And of course, Andrew Murdens and Aaron Major and all the ones that have donated all their jerseys. It's pretty cool to see. I think it's safe to call it an All Blacks factory. What's the formula? Um, there's no real secret, I don't think, but um, what we do have is a school that you know brings a lot of history and tradition behind it. Um, and I think the boys are really proud of that. So, um, you know, they turn up here, they're really keen to wear the blue and black jersey, um, and from there they play some pretty good rugby. And does it ever cross your mind when you're watching Dan Carter or any other guys, you know, and Frank's going out this afternoon, does it cross your mind that they were in your exact situation here on these fields back in the day? Yeah, I think it's, um, it's really cool watching Super Rugby and All Blacks, um, especially when you get a new player, go onto the team where you think, it was only a few years ago that he was running onto the same fields that we run onto wearing the same jersey that we are now. We saw the shirt that was half All Blacks and half Christchurch Boys High School. Yeah. How much does that reflect the journey of those players listed on the shirt? Yeah, well a big part of you know any sort of young man's life is their time here at secondary school. Uh, so they're here for five years and then um, they go on and achieve stuff after that. So I think that sort of brings it all together. So, and, you know, you're a Christchurch Boys High School uh, student into an old boy and now you're now you're an All Black. With the heritage that this school has, is there any pressure on the current players or is it more just about the pride of representing? Uh, I think the big thing is you know, the pride and representing the, the blonde black jersey. Um, definitely no pressure. I think the boys just uh, really sort of absorb that. Um, and you know, from us as coaches and from, from the school, the big thing we want from them is just to be enjoying themselves um, and that continue continued uh, growth and development within their own game. So, uh, you know, whatever's happened before them has happened and it's the opportunity now to sort of create their own sort of legacy. 